How to use Basecamp for Project Management Full Tutorial 2023. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and incredible day. I bring you back with yet another great video and in this video, we're going to be talking about Basecamp and how you can use it as your project management. Basecamp is an extremely popular project management tool that helps teams stay organized and collaborate effectively. In this video, we will cover the basics of Basecamp and how you can use it to manage your projects. So if we were to like discuss, you know, this whole program in depth, Basecamp is a web based project management tool that has been around since 2004. And it's pretty like cool, pretty nice stuff to use to work around with. It offers a simple intuitive interface that makes it easy for teams to manage their projects. And Basecamp is de designed to basically help teams stay organized, communicate effectively, and collaborate in real time. So without further ado, let's just get straight into it. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna go on Try Basecamp for free, okay? And once we go on Try Basecamp for free, we can see like the three different plans, okay? You have the Teams plan, you have the Business plan, and you have the on limited plan so obviously you can go with any one of these but we're gonna go with try for free for now okay obviously and once you go over there it's gonna ask you to put in your name okay i'm just gonna add something random your email i'm gonna be using a temp mail for this but if you're doing this for like the long run please do make sure to use your proper email and once you've done that you're gonna go ahead and set up a password so i'm just gonna set up a strong password for myself there we go and we're going to click on create my new account. Okay. So once you've done that, you're going to click on create a new account. And here we go. Just a moment while we set up your base band account, it may take up to 10 seconds. So here we are. Our base camp account has been set it up now. So here we like get welcomed and everything. Okay. Let's see my account. So here we are. Okay. Now what we're going to be doing to like, you know, get started off is create a project. So to get started with this base camp, you're going to create a project for yourself. This can be done by clicking on the make a new project button on the main dashboard. Okay. So we're just going to do that. Now, obviously you can see you'll be, you'll be prompted to enter some basic information about your project, such as the name, the description, who will be working on it and the schedule and stuff. So I'm going to put in the name like, okay, office, I'm going to put in a random description. Doesn't really matter for me right now. And once you've done that, we're going to go and click on create this project. Okay. And once you've done that, here you can see the project has been created. Now, once you have created a project, you're going to set it up and to start setting it up, what you're going to do is you're going to create to do lists, assign tasks to team members and set deadlines. Okay. And as you can see over here, to do list schedules, assigning tasks, messages and boards. So how are you going to do that? So first of all, obviously, you're going to add some people and you're just going to go here and add someone. Okay, you're going to click on the plus sign and type their names and emails and then just click on add them to the project. Now, once you've obviously done that, you're going to come back here, we're going to go back to our office. And to set us up, we're obviously going to go ahead and make some to do. So this list is renovate. Okay, let's call this renovate extra details or attach a file. So if you're going to give people details, if you want to, once you do this, you're going to click on add this to the list. And once you've done that, as you can see, uh, you've added this and you've done, you know, created a tat or, or you, you could say a to do. Now, once you have created a to do, you can also create message boards to discuss project details and shares files with your team this is also pretty cool and pretty basic stuff. So what you can do furthermore is you can describe this to do. So basically you could say this is a renovation to do assign to you can assign it to some specific person when done notify okay type names to notify select a due date so you can like select it if you want to and then you can add yourself some notes and once you've done that yeah you're pretty much good to go and as i also said from to do's you can also add message boards and in message boards you can like uh, so we can call this message and then you can just write hi post this message. Okay. And there you are. So you just started a message board and people like can add their comments and start messaging back to you. So those are also message boards that you can like must mess around with work around with if you want to. And you know, here is docs and files, you can use these to share files with your team members and stuff like that. Then you have collaborating, 
with your team features. So one of the most powerful features that Basecamp brings us is the ability to collaborate with your team in real time. You can use the message boards to discuss your project details, share files, and ask questions. You can also use the chat features to communicate with your team members directly. So again, you have a campfire where you can just be like, hi. And as you can see, this is like a casual chatting space. Then there's the message board. This is like a bit of a formal chatting space. Then obviously you can also filter these messages with like announcements for your informations, heartbeat, pitches, questions. And then you can also like edit the categories if you want to. So yeah, like pretty basic, pretty uh, abstract and robust stuff. Then you can also track progress. So Basecamp makes it extremely easy to track the progress of your project. So how do you track progress? You're going to come to project activity. And over here, you can track whatever is going on, or you can just come here in activity up here. And look at this, you have all the different progresses, like everything someone does, you can do that or and you can also like enable emailing a daily summary. So basically, whatever happens every 24 hours, you're going to get emailed a summary of it. So you can use the to do list to see what tasks have been completed and what still needs to be done to like associate with this. You can also use the calendar features to see upcoming deadlines and stuff like that. So as you can see, you have upcoming dates, your overdue to do's, you have all these features. And obviously you have pings where you can start private chats with someone. You have the lineup where you can like, you know, uh, have lineup plot projects, stuff like that. And yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. So yeah, that's a brief overview of how you can use Basecamp for project management. So yeah, Basecamp is a powerful tool that can help you stay organized and collaborate effectively with your team. If you're basically having a huge team and you want a good project management tool that is easy to use and pretty like abstract, pretty small, compact, then trust me, Basecamp is for you and your team. So uh, I hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you. And uh, if you need any more videos like this, please do tell me I am always available and I will give you the easiest step to step guide for any type of videos that you demand. And uh, if you have any queries regarding this video, you can let me know down in the comments. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'll, I guess I'll see you next time. Uh, before signing off, uh, please like and subscribe to the channel and uh, leave down a nice comment if you watch the video. And please don't forget to share this video with uh, any of your friends in need or your family. So yeah, that's basically all there is for today's video. I hope you liked it. And if you enjoyed it, please drop down a like and subscribe to the channel because it helps me out a lot, truly. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll make more for you. But yeah, until then, I hope you all keep having a great day. That was all from me and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.